It's locked. I need a key for this. Yes, you do. It says, Canis Lupus, also known as the Big Bad Wolf. His favorite snack is red hooded little girls. That's silly. Remember the missing children? Mm-hmm. Maybe he's behind it all. You think he's eating the children? Who knows? <gasps> You're right. We should call the cops on him. No, we don't want to get involved with the police. Ah, uh, okay. Hello. Are you Benjamin's cousin? You know, that fluffy fox with the most dearest big blue eyes? No? I don't know anyone called Johnny. Who's that? I'm talking about Benjamin. He's this sweet looking fox that ended up stealing my happiness. I'm not that into him anymore. Maybe you should stop talking to him and find a way inside the cage, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, all right. I'll be back, Wolf. And we'll sort this out about Benjamin. Oh my god, I've just realized the at sign on the bench. The at sign. Don't love yourself, people. That's where people go wrong. We all know we've got to love ourselves, but love each other. That's more important. Love one another. I mean, look at the at sign. That's Fibonacci expands by pi. It's the secret that's kept from all eyes. Open them. Could be a key in there. I don't know. Let's go and see. Like a little ninja, got it. Like little lady, misfortune, the ninja lady. Hayabusa! Little ninja lady has entered the room. We need to find a key now. I told you already. I'll find it. You'll see. Watch and learn how to find a key. I've got all the keys, little misfortune, all the keys to this world, but they don't want them. They enjoy the game, so let them play it. Maybe we can find a clue in the computer. Yeah, but it needs a password. I'll find it. Inside, but you know, these boots are made for walking, and that's just what they'll do. Miss Fortune, focus. Okay, okay. I'll check those buckets. Mm, look, I found a paper with some numbers on it. Keep it, it might be helpful. Okay. It says, Safety rules. For handling the big bad wolf, if the wolf runs at you, ready to attack, then you shall not have any regrets about your life, because you will most probably die. <laughs> so if I don't have regrets, the wolf will let me pet it? What? <laughs> huh, a secret inside? Fancy! Is there a king? Oh, another doll. When broken hearts are chosen to receive the gift from the beyond. A gift, you say? What's that? Nothing. Any keys inside the bucket? Nah. Check out my computer skills. I bet the password is this one. Wait, Miss Fortune. I think you're holding the paper upside down. Don't interrupt me. I know what I'm doing. Keep quiet. Mm. 
It's interesting. It's upside down. Urania's mirror, which is interesting. Little reference there. Hidden trail of bread crumbs. <laughs> oh my god, life is but a game. Bands by Pi Fibonacci and look at the way they draw that at sign look at the way it goes up and drifts off that's interesting oh the thinking man's world Unexpected. Not to me. Animals usually run away from me. That's too bad. But hey, the note is right there. I'm gonna take it. It says, My evil cousin's address. Fox, Spooks, Tegan, 15. Open fields. It's Benjamin's address. Good. Now we can get that stolen happiness back. All right, sweet. It looks like the fastest way to the fox is by boat from Phantasmagoria. Wait a minute. Are you telling me we are going to Phantasmagoria? It seems that way, yes. Sweet. I always wanted to go, yes. <laughs> Are you up for another round of questions while we walk? Sure. My question answering skills are all warm up. Great. Great. And, as usual, just be honest and you'll do fine. <laughs> First question. Have you ever heard this question before? All right, second question. Have you ever lied to a friend? No, I swear. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. Now, for the last question. Have you ever seen someone die? I saw Grandad die. It was very calm. Not like in the movies. It was different. I told him to come haunt me as a ghost, but he hasn't done it yet. 
Thank you for your honesty again, Miss Fortune. <laughs> You're welcome. We're getting really close to Phantasmagoria now. Yeah, I can hear. <laughs> Exciting. Wow, this looks like the creepiest place to ever exist. So scary. I wish I had a ticket to ride, though. Really? But hey, what's that falling just in front of you? Please, don't play with my feelings. It can't be a ticket. Are you sure? It looks like a ticket to me. It can't be, but I'll check it out. <laughs> what? A ticket? For real? Sweet and spooky. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, Miss Fortune. Now, let's go find a boat to the fox, remember? Mm-hmm. Is that a skeleton? <gasps> Crap! <-er. laughs> a ghost! Damn, that's creepy. -er. Miss Fortune, please mind your language. But I got scared. It's totally understandable. That's no excuse. Okay. It says, Welcome to Phantasmagoria. <laughs> Thank you. <gasps> A creepy clown? That's creepy. <gasps> oh, balloons. I love balloons. Just so you know that I love balloons. <laughs> okay, Miss Fortune. Hey, you, from the other side. Miss Fortune deserves to have a fun time. So try to make the right choices for her, all right? Hmm, I just have one ticket, so I can just ride one ride. I'm gonna look around first. All right. Hey, you know, once I saw a documentary on TV about hot dogs. And now, I don't want to eat hot dogs. Boo! Ah! Sorry about that. I was just trying to pull your leg. If you do it one more time, I'll just shut my eyes tight and see nothing. This looks like Benjamin, but creepier and angrier. Check out those sweet unicorns! Look, little baby sweet unicorn! This is your family. Say hello. Did you say? Okay. Now say bye-bye, and we'll go. Is this the ride you want to spend your ticket on? Sure yet. I'm gonna look around more. The mean children at school say that I have a pumpkin head. I can see the resemblance. The what? Nothing. Huh, okay. Smell of freshly made candy is delightful. Ah, oh, yes. Too bad we can't afford any. There's some candy on the ground. I could use the party hat to make my own mixed candy corn. Come on, Miss Fortune. Don't even think about it. I'm doing it. Ugh. Are you really gonna eat some of it? forever. I was just kidding. <laughs> ah, you almost had me there, Miss Fortune. I'm a funny little lady. Before we leave, don't you want to use your ticket? Ah, 
yes, my ticket, of course. So good. I'm feeling this. Uh, you think you're going to puke? I don't want to. But the ride went too fast. It was fun. All right, good. Take a deep breath and you'll soon feel better. <sighs> okay. Good, good. Now, let's go find that boat. The boat? <sighs> okay, I'm okay. Use my ticket. I can't write this one. Hera? Ah, oh, there's a bunch of games here. Can I play one? Oh, of course, you must play one before we leave on the boat. I just love it here, don't you? <laughs> Who doesn't? <laughs> I want to play a game now. Mr. Voice, can I get a balloon? Because my mommy never gave me one. So maybe you can give me one. Well, you know we can't afford any, but look! What's that? A floating balloon! Is it for me? Yes! Okay, <laughs> thank you. Ah, uh, here's my luck. Oh, Miss Fortune, I'm sorry about the balloon. Don't worry. Thank you anyway. This one is free. I want to play it. Oh, please, do play it. Play it as much as you want. Really? All right. Well, check this out. Now with real bullets. Bonsu! I... I think I broke the game. It looks like it. Oh. Check this out. I can get a reward ticket if I win. <laughs> I'm gonna play this. Please, go ahead. I can't wait to see what it's about. Are these tiny foxes like Benjamin? They're dangerous foxes. Pretend they all stole your eternal happiness and whack them. Whack them! Okay. <laughs> Well, you can try as many times as you want. Ah, okay. Great 
whacking misfortune. Check those sweet rewards! A golden sugarly coin, a cute tiny skirt, and a doll. Oh, sweet! Let's see what I can get. That golden sugarly coin looks delicious. I'll take that. Fortune teller, can I try this? Hello, I'm Miss Fortune, Ramirez Hernandez, and I want to know the future of me. Please, thank you. <laughs> Once you see the beyond, the beyond sees you, and you can be sure it will be coming for you. <gasps> The Beyond is coming for me? <laughs> What's the Beyond? Want to try again? Yes, again. What you see in the Beyond is not what you see, but what you don't see. Oh, really? <laughs> Talk about crazy. Want to try it again then? Okay, okay, again. You are being lied to at this very moment. Trust me, Mimi. Don't trust anything. Oh, really? Who is lying to me? Is Benjamin lying to me? <gasps> what? Oh no, too bad. Yes, poor little birdie. Maybe he was flying drunk. You know, like my mommy did once and crushed daddy's car. Like this little birdie crushed with its body, you know? Yes, I get it, Miss Fortune. It's still sad. It crushed.
Oh no, too bad. Yes, poor little birdie. Maybe it was flying, you know? Like my like this little birdie. Yes, I get it. It's crushed. Transform into what the child desires the most. Oh, really? A desire, you say? I like desires. What did you choose? Nothing. <laughs> I know who will look amazing in this tiny skirt. Shut up! <laughs> there you go, unicorn. You look like a sweet little lady. It says you need one golden coin to ride the boat. Huh, okay. Check this boat out. It's like a black swan. How cool is that? Really, really cool. Tell me about it. Anyway, this boat will take you where you need to go. You mean to Benjamin's house? Yes, and it's just one golden coin. I got the sweet chocolate coin reward. Is that good? I don't think that would... No, see, it's fine. Oh. Look at that. Well, are you ready to leave? This is going to be so cool. I hope we don't get attacked by pirates, though. <laughs> or the Kraken. What's a Kraken? Well, if you see it, you know. But tell me, I'm curious now. We don't have time for that, misfortune. Just forget it. Ugh, but now I'll think about it forever. Ugh. Kraken, if you appear in front of me, I will see you. And if I see you, I will know it is you. Sweet Kraken, come up in front of me right now. Ugh, what's a freaking Kraken? Hey, this place is very quiet. Is one allowed to talk? Anyway, I was thinking... Is the Kraken available for petting? You know, like uh, some pet doggies, some pet kitties. I want to pet the Kraken, if it's possible. Well, I heard you could lure it out with fish. With fish, you say? 
Well, I don't have any fish on me. I guess I won't be petting the cray gun. <gasps> Was that the fish from the bridge? <laughs> I think he is happy because I saved him. You remember I saved him from the bridge, remember? Yes, I remember. Did you see the kiss he gave me <laughs> on my mouth? Because he was in love with me. Because I saved him. <laughs> Somebody loves me. Hey, Mysterious, are you taking me now to the house of Benjamin? You know, that blue-eyed, soft, fluffy fox who happens to be a great artist and stole my happiness? You don't seem to want to talk about it. And why is that you collect coins? That's how you pay for your rent and food, right? Miss Fortune, just leave him alone. No, he wants to hear. Anyway, do you like to eat sushi? I know about sushi because I have a Japanese ghost friend. By the way, can you speak Japanese? I need some translations. Do you know what this means? Kiriba doko desu ka? So you don't know, huh? You know, I've never been outside this late by myself. Do you go outside by yourself this late every day? Are you going to eat my chocolate coin? Because I'm a bit hungry. Ah, stop talking! Ah, why should I stop talking? Nobody else is talking. Hey, Mysterious, where are you going? Oh no, can he swim? Hello? That's what happens when little ladies ask too many questions. It makes people want to drown themselves. Ah, stop it. I'm pretty sure he'll be fine. Look, we have arrived. Check that out. It's the toy graveyard, I'm telling you. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune. What time is it? It's getting really dark. Mr. Voice, are you there? Hello? There's something wrong here. Something very wrong. What's wrong, Mr. Voice? What do you mean? It's coming. Hide. Hide. I don't know what you're playing, but if you scare me, I'll close my eyes. Kato? What are you running away from? Is it the fox? I'm pretty sure it was the fox. No, it's the monster. I saw it again. You don't know what you're talking about. Yes, I do. I saw it. Don't make any sudden moves. Filthy paws, you beast. 
Stop it. You're scaring him away. Don't leave, Benjamin. Please, Miss Fortune, stop and listen to me. There's something I need to tell you. If you keep running, you'll end up badly hurt, and I don't want that. You're too important. But I want to find Benjamin. He was nice to me. Trust me, he's dangerous. Stop running, please. <laughs> Really? You don't remember me saying if you keep running, you'll end up hurt? Mm-hmm. I know, I could have been more specific, like, there's a bear trap up ahead, stop or you will be hurt. But I felt like getting straight to the point. Okay, okay, thank you. Who left a bear trap here anyway? I haven't seen any bears. Well, I don't want to point any fingers, but it was obviously the fox also. I don't like the fox. I have what you call foxophobia. Is that true? Yes, I swear. Now, let's focus on the eternal happiness again. <laughs> All right. Oh, this makes me think about Bubsy, you know? Did, did I show you Bubsy the teddy in the secret spot? He will... These bear traps, because he's a teddy bear. He lives in a world of fantasy where there are no bear traps. And if he will go in the woods, he will see this and not know he's dying. Now I see Bubsy being killed by a bear trap. That's how it is now. He's dead. Bubsy died. What are you talking about? About Bubsy, don't you listen? Let's keep going now, Miss Fortune. Bye, Bubsy. Trapped dead in the bear trap. This makes me think about Bubsy, you know? Did, did I show you Bubsy the teddy in the secret spot? He will be very sad to know about this, you know? These bear traps, because he's a teddy bear. He lives in a world of fantasy where there are no bear traps. And if he will go in the woods, he will see this and not know he's dying. Now I see Bubsy being killed by a bear trap. That's how it is now. He's dead. Bubsy died. What are you talking about? About Bubsy, don't you listen? Let's keep going now, Miss Fortune. Bye, Bubsy. Trap dead in the bear trap. Let's see what this one says. It's stuck. Huh. The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really? Interesting. The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really? Interesting. It's stuck, huh? It's stuck, huh? The elimination of Prime Me will dissolve the filth of the beyond. Oh, really? Interesting. The games you enjoy, you can have them all. Oh, nice. A sixth doll, it's got a six on it. 
That's dodgy, man. This game is completely weird for me. What are you doing? Nothing. Oh, uh, this makes me think about Bubsy, you know? Did, did I show you Bubsy the Teddy in the secret spot? He will be very sad to know about this, you know? These bear traps. Because he's a teddy bear. He lives in a world of fantasy where there are no bear traps. And if he will go in the woods, he will see this and not know he's dying. Now I see Bubsy being killed by a bear trap. That's how it is now. He's dead. Bubsy died. What are you talking about? About Bubsy, don't you listen? Let's keep going now, Miss Fortune. Bye, Bubsy. Trap dead in the bear trap. So, Miss Fortune, I have a couple of questions for you. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Wonderful. Now, just be honest and think about it before answering. First question. Do you believe in magic? Yes, yes, I do. When mommy and daddy scream, I go to my secret hiding spot. And in my secret spot, they never drink juice and never scream at me. That's magical, don't you think? <laughs> oh, yes. Yes, it is, my sweet child. Moving on, second question. Do you trust me? No, you're just a voice in my head. Mommy talks to herself a lot, too. She says it's her inner demons and that they just keep them away. I'm sorry to hear that. Hi, are you my inner demon? Me? A demon? <laughs> no. Nah, you can't be a demon. Not with a silly voice. <laughs> well, anyway. Now, for the third question. Are you afraid of dying? No, I'm not afraid of death because all, all, all dead people I know never came back from being dead. So it must be pretty cool to be dead. <laughs> well, I guess you'll find out when you die. Looks like there's going to be a storm. Oh no, I hope it doesn't rain that much. I don't like my feet getting wet. I'm a little lady, you know. Hey. Look at that. I think we're here. Benjamin! Stay cool, Miss Fortune. I'm cool. I'll keep an eye out here while you go inside and look for clues. I'm sure that Fox has hidden the eternal happiness here. Make sure the cabin is empty, and if you see the Fox, run. All right. It looks like Benjamin's good at cutting wood. He must be so muscular. <laughs> be brave, Miss Fortune. Okay, I will look around. Maybe I can find my eternal happiness. If Benjamin has it, I ask him to share the prize with us and everything will be fine. Is this Benjamin's? He got some sweet style. I like it. Whoa, a video player. Bonsu! Let's see. Benjamin's on TV? <laughs> Is that the monster? Damn it, I broke Benjamin's tape. I 
can fix it. Happiness to the video player! <laughs> oh, what a cozy couch. Is that Benjamin's diary? I won't spy on Benjamin's personal stuff. Looks like Benjamin likes to educate himself. I like that in a fox. <laughs> Looks like Benjamin likes to educate himself. I like that in a fox. <laughs> mm, that tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend. Because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Hmm, Mr. Voice said that I shouldn't trust a fox. Mmm, that tea smells like roses and lemon. I bet it's called Benjamin's Blend, because I can almost smell his paws blending the ingredients. Maybe I should try it out. Mmm, it definitely tastes like his fluffy paws. Mmm, delicious! Ugh, I feel weird. Butter? What? Oh. Look at that. Benjamin looks so pretty in that hat. <laughs> Benjamin! I'm really sorry I broke your video player, but you stole the eternal happiness. It was promised to me if I beat the game. I really want it back. We can totally share it if you want. Are you afraid of the thunder, Benjamin? Don't worry, you can hold my hand if you want to. Oh, what are you? Is this a kiss? Is this really happening? What is that? Is that your diary? You want me to read it? Is that what you're afraid of? I think I saw him too.
can't hide the children. Are you rescuing me, Benjamin? Like if I was a girl in trouble? Benjamin, where do you go? Oh no, is this Benjamin? There's a hole behind the painting. Hello? I can't reach it. I'm a little lady, you know. Uh-huh. Such a clever little lady. Time to use my ninja skills. Shh, what a bad crack. Be quiet. This is a ninja mission. <laughs> it's not Jenny. Benjamin, are you here? So it was, but, but Benjamin seems so nice. Maybe he put them for that monster. Hmm, kind of fish balls? This is like sushi balls. Hmm, a picture of a key. Interesting. My ninja senses are telling me to climb up on this chair. Hmm, a real ninja. A secret button. Alright then, I push the button. Easy. All right, time to find Benji. Oh. oh, that was unfortunate. I hope things get better when I get the eternal happiness. Okay, Miss Fortune. Get up, Miss Fortune. You are stronger than you think. You've been knocked down before. Did you let that stop you? Get up, Miss Fortune. You can do it. Because... Because... You are the little lady, Miss Fortune. <laughs> okay, I'm out again. Anyone here? Bungie? Mr. Voice? I guess I'm alone. Oh, a baby deer. So sweet. Mm, dream come true. I'm petting the baby deer. <laughs> Is that Benjamin's bag? Benjamin? Are you around? He must be in trouble. I'm very disappointed in you, Miss Fortune. Ah, uh, there you are. Hey, have you seen Benjamin? I think he's in trouble. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'm very disappointed in you. Mr. Voice, please, stop playing games. 
You have lied to me all the time, and that's very sucky. I knew I couldn't trust you. What are you talking about? Benjamin made it really clear with a picture he showed me. You're the one taking the children, and I... I'm not the hero of this game, right? I guess the eternal happiness was all a lie. Stop this nonsense. We have to keep playing my game. You can't make me. Yes, I can. Stop that! Then play with me. You need to find your eternal happiness. I'll give you a clue. It's at home, waiting for you. I'm sick of that eternal happiness. I don't want it anymore. You can't say that. That would break the rules. You heard me. I don't want the eternal happiness anymore. I won't tolerate this behavior. I'll be waiting for you at home. Now, tell me where Benjamin is. What do you do to him? Freaking monster. Let's see what's inside. Maybe a clue where to find Benjamin. Oh, this is really mysterious. This is really mysterious. We got to get free, man. Ultra reality. Busby. Guardian of the secret spot. Let's go. Let's go.
paint. I like to paint. The what? Now I will never know. With the what? Now I will never know. Paint? I like to paint. She done a deal with the devil. <gasps> Is that Benjamin as a baby? <laughs> so cute. I'll take the train back home. Now when I look at this, I can see what Benjamin tried to warn me about. He knew all along. Such a foxy boy. Okay, I'll wait here. Waiting, waiting for a little while. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna talk to myself. So, Miss Fortune, how have you been? Okay, I have this, like, weird day. I saw monsters, I saw dolls, I saw Benjamin. And then I went to the zoo and everything was everywhere. And then I realized Mr. Voice had lied to me a lot. And he took Benjamin. And now I'm alone. I don't like being alone. Wow, sounds like you had one hell of a day, Miss Fortune. The train is here. It was a nice chat, Miss Fortune. <laughs> Talk to you later. You go, girl. <laughs> I have my coloring book with me. Ugh. Hello, Hiro. I didn't recognize you. <laughs> Such a coincidence that you're on the same train as me. You know, I had a big fight with the silly voice in my head. I get the feeling that Mr. Voice is not who he says he is. Have you ever heard voices in your head? I know Hira. What does it mean? It's the monster! Leave Hira alone! Tuscada! Tuscada!
I hope I get to see Hiro again. I wonder what that monster did to him. Uh, now I have to walk all the way back home alone. This is the last time I follow a voice in my head. If Benjamin was here, he would walk with me. Uh. Benjamin was warning me all the time, but I couldn't see it. I wanted that eternal happiness so bad. I'm a silly little lady. That's what I am. Oh. At least I had fun at Phantasmagoria. <laughs> I'm gonna tell mommy about it. Oh. Oh. Excuse me. I'm talking over here. Well, if that's how you treat little ladies, then give yourself a fuck. We got red lights. I like them. Mommy, I'm back. Hello? What's that sound? Benji? Congratulations, you reached the end of my game. Leave me alone. I'm looking for Mommy and Benjamin. There's no eternal happiness for you. I don't even care anymore. Of course you care. You know your mommy needs it. It's your responsibility. Yes, I guess you're right. Good, good. Ready for a new game? If I play alone, will you give me back Benjamin? I guess I will, but only if you truly commit to the game. Okay. Splendid. You will love my new game. <laughs> this is Miss Fortune. She's a wonderful child from a not so wonderful family. A little sparkle for you, and a little sparkle for you. Wait a minute. Didn't I do this already? What? No, you're not doing this correctly. Then you say something about me dying today, which is totally not true, by the way. <clears throat> Wait. Stop talking, please. Are we going to play another game, or is this like what? I don't understand. If you can reach the end of the game, I'll give you eternal happiness. And then you say deal, and I say yes. Stop ruining this! Uh, eternal happiness? No deal! Wonderful! Fantastic! Ready to... wait... what? No deal! No... no... Uh, how about this? What if the fox was waiting for you in the hallway? If the game is about Benjamin and you leaving me alone, I'll play along. Sure, sure. I promise you know the way. If Mr. Voice scares me again... Huh, is this a new dance song? I have a little hunch that Miss... Oh, 
Okay, I'm just gonna play his game one last time. was a beautiful example of cause and effect. Ma, you lied to me. I don't want to play this game anymore. Fine. Let me come up with a new game to play. New game. Knock, knock. Who's there? No, I don't want to play with you anymore. Knock, knock. Who's there? You're scaring me, stop it! Leave me alone! Knock, knock, who's there? 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 What happened here? My secret spot, he won't find me in there. Open this door right now, Miss Fortune. We have a new game to play. No, I told you already. I don't want to play with you anymore. Oh, sweet unicorn. Please take me to your rainbow kingdom. So now we're playing hide and seek. I love that game. No, leave me alone. All right. Just so you know, my game is the only thing keeping you alive. Is that one more of your lies? I will live forever with Benjamin, and there's nothing you can do about it. Will you please stop talking about that fox? He's been trying to take you away from me all the time. And his ugly paintings. Ugh. Oh no, you don't talk like that about my Benjamin. You know what? I'm done with you. I want you to leave. Right now. You don't have a clue about what's going on. This is not the last game you play with me, Miss Fortune. This is only the beginning. No, we made a deal. You crossed the path, and now you're mine. Benjamin! How did you get here? There's nothing you can do. She belongs to me. Is everything back to normal now? Benjamin saved me. Benji, are you around? I guess I have to rebuild this. I'll make some improvements. I want to find Benjamin.
Benjamin, did you go outside? Morgo is coming. Open your eyes. He's the voice in your head, driving you mad. Well, now I know what to call me. Benjamin, where are you? ignore me are you angry because I couldn't get the happiness for you what's happening Mommy? <laughs> this must be a bad dream taking me somewhere else because I have nothing against it but I have to talk with my mommy first mommy I'm going to go somewhere else with Benji okay he's the fox that I like I'm a little lady you know that's what I am I guess I was your little misfortune for a while but you need to find your own happiness now. I love you forever. Stop, Benjamin. Where are we going? Benji?
This place is really cold. Disasters seem to disappear. Deep inside the fog, you defeat him. Huh, I guess Mr. Boy's game is over now. Benji? Fortune, that's who I am. Lady Misfortune? Yes, you could say that. Good. Step inside. We were expecting you. What is this place? Mad game, mad meaning, mad world, mad Busby. Fuck it, fuck all y'all. <laughs> Lead programmer, Isa, like a sire. Secrets, 